Hey everybody, what's up? My name's Ocean Slim, and I'm here with a new series today. Uh, that would be Pokemon Showdown. So the reason I really haven't been making a bunch of videos in the first place is because I've been playing a lot of Pokemon on my DS, and I wish I could record that, but a 3DS capture card is like $300, and I gotta send my DS off somewhere to get it installed, and most places it's gonna only do the new 3DS now, so I'd have to buy a new system for like 200 bucks, then turn around and pay 300 It's too much money to get to be able to record my DS, but I play a lot of Pokemon on that DS. Um, the second reason I have not recorded a lot of videos is because my computer went down, my solid state went down, I had a whole thing there for a minute where I had to transfer a lot of stuff here and there, and that's the whole gist of the thing. Anyways, I'm back to make videos, and I'm going to start with some Showdown videos because they're really simple. I'm just going to play Showdown for like 10 minutes or so, and uh, or I'm going to start, or I'm going to stop it, or whenever the battle finishes up after 10 minutes, that's when I'll stop the video. So it might be two or three battles. Now, um, since this is the first in the, in the series, it's going to be a little bit longer because I have a little bit of time for explanation right now of how the series is going to go. Uh, essentially, to make things really quick, I'm I'm decent at Pokemon. I, I know some things. I'm not awesome. Um, I really am not the Pokemon master. But I know more than your average person. So if, if competitive Pokemon is something you really want to get into, this might be a good thing for you to watch. Um, because I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to make great moves. I'm going to mess up, and you can learn from my mistakes. Not only can you learn from my mistakes, but I can learn from my mistakes. I can learn from you guys commenting on the video saying, well, you know, Ocean, you should have done this, or you should have done that. Um, and all that, and, and, and we'll just make these videos every once in a while, because I think they'll be really easy to do, and, uh, two minutes in, I guess, I guess we're gonna go ahead and do a battle. Now, I'm gonna do some random battles. I'm just gonna do random battles, uh, for the most part, to begin with. Eventually, I'll get into, uh, some of the tiers here, the OU and the Ubers and the UU and stuff like that, but I'm waiting until Sun and Moon, uh, they kind of balance it out and everything, because they're still trying to figure out exactly uh, what to ban and what to put and what's here because it's a new game so without further ado let's let's go ahead and get started and uh, I'm gonna check the clock real quick all right 709 so at uh, 719 stop if a one battle takes that long then that's how long it takes we're gonna start off with Pinsir here uh, if you know a little bit of basics about Pokemon you got rock poison and bug poison trash is bug um, but Pinsir is my mega Pokemon so I do want to definitely keep him alive. Rock Poison is not going to be very good against Rock, and Gigalith is a super, super tanky kind of guy. Um, we also have Buzzwool. Let's switch into Gigalith. I think that might be my best switch right here. Which is also going to bring in a Sandstream. He's going to Stealth Rock. Um, he's Poison Rock. I'm going to go with. I'm going to go with. I'm gonna go with superpower because I think that's probably just my best move. He's, uh, Gigalith is not uh, really that great against Nihiligo, but you know, I'm gonna start this battle timer. All right, let's go. He's gonna switch out to Blastoise, which also trashes Gigalith. Um, the Sandstream is gonna wear him down. That was not a great switch out but I don't have any electric types. So that's not fantastic. He is going to hit me with a pretty strong attack. I need to switch out to something because he's going to really kill Gigalith. Let's see. Let's do Raticate because he's not that great, and I don't really care if I lose him that bad. He's probably going to Hydro Pump. Oh, no, that's his Mega, and he's going to Hydro Pump. Um, let's see. He's also going to get buffeted by the Sandstorm. Uh, I could probably Sucker Punch it. Um, unless he tries to Swords Dance or something, but it, I can get a Sucker Punch off at least. Um, sucker Punch hits him uh, if he tries to use a physical attack. I hit first, which is great because that's going to wear him down pretty well. The Sandstream is going to take him out pretty good. Let's see, he's going to get hurt by the Sandstream, and let's switch to something really good defense. Let's go to Floridus, and let's try to let's try to take him out. Uh oh. I have aromatherapy, but it's that's a that's a healing move. I also have wish. Why do I have wish and aromatherapy? Hmm. I wonder if 
Now we're just gonna moon blast. Let's moon blast. Ooh, he has ice beam. Did not see that coming. I'm gonna take out his mega though. He's got a beast left. I also have a beast, uh, ultra beast. If you're not familiar with Sun and Moon, there's several ultra beasts. Um, that would be an ultra beast. Rock poison against fairy. I bet he thinks Lord just is a grass, but he's not. Rock poison. Rock poison. Rock poison. Um. Have anything great for rock poison? I don't think I. Let's see. Uh, earthquake ground might be good against rock. I think earthquake would take it out pretty good. Um. Hmm. Let's see, you don't have any psychic at all. This is not a very great team. Um, we can we can moon blast or maybe we'll moon blast. And then aromatherapy. Although he does have acid spray, that's not gonna be great. I, you know, staying in like this is not necessarily great for Florges. I do outspeed him, so I'm gonna heal up. He's gonna set spikes and stuff, and I don't have. Mm, wish. I'm gonna do a wish real quick. Set set that wish. Wish is going to heal after one turn. He's going to Acid Spray. That's great. Wish. I do have Leftovers. Protect. So I can Wish Protect. That'll keep me alive. And, uh... Oh, he's going to keep Stealth rocking. That's okay. I don't think he can, um... Hmm. I want to try to get... Why does he keep stealth rocking? That's stupid. Alright, I'm gonna wish protect again. Because he's not really calling my shots that great. Oh, protect against acid spray. Wish come true. Alright, switch out. I'm gonna switch out now into something that is not gonna get screwed. Um, although, I am gonna get poisoned and... Oh man, he's set up good. Ugh. It sucks. Um. I could set up on him, but. Eh. I don't really have. Let's, let's see. Let's, uh, giggle at the attack. 252 is pretty good. It's pretty good. Let's try that. Let's try that. And then I'm gonna set up if I can. He's gonna switch out again. Ooh! Ooh, that was not good for him. He switched out to an ice did not call my fighting type move. Alright. So, I'm gonna keep storing with leftovers, but I'm severely weakened. <laughs> Pretty bad, and I'm also poisoned. I'm waiting for the opponent. Let's go, let's go. Two minutes, dog. You got two minutes to decide. You got three Pokemon left. Firefighting. That was stupid. Stone Edge. Duh. I don't think he can kill me. Oh, he's gonna Swords Dance. That was dumb. Oh, wow. Hmm. Well. Poison might take me out, but... I don't think... Let's see. I might have time... I might have time... Let's... I'll set up a Stealth Rock. Ooh, I did not see his Mach Punch come in. That's not good. Alright. Man, I forgot I have Florges, too. That that is not good. <laughs> and I don't have anything that can really clean up field hazards, that which sucks. Um, he does not have very many Pokemon left. I haven't used my Mega. He has. He's got an Ultra Beast, but it's pretty weak from what I remember. Let's go into let's go into Sock. Let's go into Sock, and uh, he's gonna get poisoned. That's fine. And let's Earthquake him. Uh, he's gonna outspeed, I think. I think. Let's see, what do I have? Leftovers? Yeah. yeah. He's gonna outspeed. He's gonna hit first, unless he switches out. Which would be stupid, because he's bonus attack. Man, that's not good. <laughs> that's really not good. He's got, so he's got Mach Punch, he's got a Fire Attack, and it's gonna kill me. Oh, Flare Blitz, and that takes him out. That was stupid of him. He could've swept my team with that Pokemon. 
Uh, he's either gonna switch into something else. I guess... Let's go ahead and get Buzzwall out. Go ahead and do that. Alright. Buzzwall, get poisoned, son. Ooh, he chose the perfect Pokemon. That sucks. <laughs> uh, what should I do here? Where do we go from here? Oh, let me think for a second, guys. Let me think. I'm gonna think real quick. I'm thinking. I don't have any ground psychic moves. Oh, Pinsero's Earthquake. It's also a bug against a massively poison type. I might as well use some sort of Stone Edge, I guess. Leech Life is pretty good. I mean, it's not, not good against Muck. Eh, I'm gonna Stone Edge. Ooh, he's not a very strong Muck. Oh, wow. That was dumb. Can't believe he used Memento. He pretty much gave him up. Heat more. Also suck against Heat more. But I'm probably gonna outspeed. I get the super effective. That's gonna kill me. <laughs> I knew that was coming. I already knew that was coming. Um, I bet you... Man, I really don't want him to take him out, but at the same time, I think... Stones are going to hit Pinsir pretty bad. Poison's going to hit him pretty bad, but I think I can Earthquake. I think I can Earthquake for the win. Yes. Earthquake. Poison. And I think we got this game. I think we got it. Alright, alright, alright. So yeah, this one match took about 10 minutes or so, so... Oh man, I didn't know Nihiligo had that much. Uh... Uh, rock poison against a bug flying, so... Eh. I do outspeed, for sure. I outspeed. By, like, three points. If he's speed EV'd. Uh... What's gonna hit Nihaligo the, the hardest? I wonder... Let's see, what's gonna hit him? What's gonna hit... Nihaligo the hardest? Ground type noob. Let's just do Earthquake again. Oh, super effective knock him out. That's the game. Awesome. Well, that was about 10 minutes, you guys. So I guess the whole video will be about 12 minutes or so. Um, that was a that was a good match. That was a good match. Um, if you guys want to see more, let me know. Uh, follow me on Twitter if you'd like to. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see more for sure. And uh, get the updates on whenever I release videos. Hopefully, I'll be making a lot more here recently. And um, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.